Okay, we are back. We are up against the uh, German Thurgenden class, which are actually slightly faster and have the same broadside as my guys do. There's two of them. And that's it. There's only two of them. There's two of their battleships versus three of mine, and then they have their dreadnoughts following up behind. All of my sh battleships have bigger guns than theirs do. Good Hope is turned around and running back towards the main battle fleet going, yep, we're not fighting that. Let's see, Mackleburg, Lothrin. Yeah, their pre-dreadnoughts are not particularly impressive, and their dreadnought dreadnought is... meh. I think we can take this guy to full speed now. Turn that on so we can see what way the guns are facing. Are they going to run away again? <sighs> don't run. Seriously, don't run. You turn north. You turn south. Nope, nope, nope. Turn this way again. Here we go. The firing has begun. Battleships are now involved. Shooting at the Victoria class. We'll take that off because it's less clutter. Yeah, you're not hitting with the big guns. One of the turrets is disabled already. I'm going to slow down to 18 knots so the battle line doesn't get too disorganized. of my BBs were hit. This was this one. Uh, disable the turret. Oh, and there's a battle cruiser here too. Revenge has been hit. No damage to the revenge. They're going to leave. How dare they? Are they seriously just going to turn around and leave? Mecklenburg's hit. Victoria Louise is hit again and again. Destroyer's been hit. They're not staying to fight. Revenge has been hit turret T, but it doesn't do anything. My fleet's improved gunnery is showing. I'm hitting them a lot more than they're hitting me. I think I can up this to normal speed. Do, 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 do. Louise hit again. Yeah, how much are they... Are they, like, focusing fire on any of my ships? Log entries. 22 rounds fired at it. None hit. That's... Well, they're taking minuses from focusing the fire like that, because it's hard to aim. And, um... That's still kind of sad. In 22 rounds, at, like, 1%, they still can't hit. Really showing these pre dreadnoughts something. So who was hit and how? When it's flooding. Armor pushed in. Mm, that's not very good. I'm beating up these bees. Heavy damage. Look at it. One turret's out. Light damage to that one. Medium damage to that one. Probably, the damage probably isn't as bad as the captains and the observers think, but hey, it's something. What way are those guys going? They're heading for Emden. So the enemy battleships are retreating. I'll leave these battleships to retreat and I'll focus these things down.
Anything I can take out is a bonus. Even if I don't take out their... Um, dreadnoughts. I'll take out these old pre-dreadnoughts here. Take that, V1 class. Yeah, you might as well. Turn north. Oh, we've also cut off their battle cruisers from retreat, too. So let that part of the fleet retreat. And we'll catch these guys at sea. Cut them off from port. I'm running out of ammo. Brilliant. Yes, yeah, so you got less than 50% ammo remaining. Frankly, I don't think these guys, the enemy, have any ammunition left either. We turn that way. We'll expose the other two turrets. These side, these two turrets here that haven't been firing, because they still got ammunition. We we'll use that to take these things out, which only do 18 knots at best. So yeah, their heavier ships will get away, like their battle cruisers. I'm not too concerned about that. That is actually something I am okay with. Because this will still get me a very good victory here, isolating these three ships and taking them down. Not counting a destroyer. Medium damage. Medium damage. Yeah, it's not quite the Gouda Gras if I had gotten their two battleships and then those battle cruisers, but this is this will be fine. This will be fine. Come on, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Get in there and get him. Catch up to the old Mecklenburg. Actually, you know what? Flotilla attack. They're damaged enough. I think the destroyers can go in there and launch torpedoes and do some real damage to them and take him out. What are you doing over there by yourself? Because I let you just keep sailing in the direction. Trace these CLs down. The fact that you haven't... Well, you've probably been getting fired at. But only one round has hit you. Yeah, so these guys are now heading back towards port. And my destroyers are not doing a destroyer flotilla attack. got these CLs down there. You following anyone? You're a scout. And you guys have basically run off on your own. Come on. You are faster than them, so you should be able to come off and come back down around and cut them off again. Gunfire is so ineffective. Oh, now the destroyers decide to go, Yeah, we got this flotilla attack order. Let's do it, guys. And they got themselves sunk.
We're just gonna run out of ammunition and not do anything, is what's gonna happen here. Dodging torpedoes! And. You guys gonna hit anything? Probably not. Completely inconsequential battle. I'm reasonably sure I caused a lot more damage to the German fleet than they caused to me. I already know I did one because that thing sunk. But then I lost a destroyer up there too, so... And now Tartar is sinking, so that's two destroyers gone. Are you the new one? No, you're not. You're not the new type. That would have sucked. Yeah, this is pretty much over. Oh, we found one! Turn into it! Nail it! This is our final chance to kill something! You've caught it at point blank! We got one! Don't torpedo yourselves! Don't run into each other now! Woohoo! We got one! We salvaged the battle for something useful! I call that a victory! A great victory! Close enough to one at least! Let's go home. Compared to how that could have gone, that still that went va quite rather well. But we didn't manage to get their true dreadnought class ships. Just kind of circled around each other and didn't do much. Minor victory. They lost a B, medium damage to two others, the destroyer. We managed to land a lot more shells than they did. Except this guy has the highest accuracy rate. Fired one shell, one hit, then he sunk. 100% hit rate. Congratulations. You get the derp award. Wait, you're alive! <laughs> you lived! Okay. So that's where their fleet ended up. Down there. The rest of it ran into Emden. That should be a major victory, because ultimately I am in charge of the sea. Yes. Under construction... Build more subs. I want you to build 40 submarines. Build a lot of submarines because that will actually do the job. <sighs> Nine months for that Jupiter, 13 months for both the battle cruisers. Turn. Oh, sure. Yeah, I'll do that. Hmm. Doesn't cost me to do anything, so I'll do that. Destroyer action. Unexpected battle. I will take care of this one real quick. Hopefully it'll be the new destroyers. They're going to be... Core. What kind of destroyers do we have here? It is not the new ones. What about you? You're not the new ones. We'll pop in, launch a couple of shells at them, and pop away. 
There we go. Launch a couple shells. Throw it away. Shush, shush. This episode will last a little bit longer. I've got no intentions of fighting their destroyer flotillas. Particularly not if it's the really old destroyers that pop up into them. And there's a sneeze coming. <coughs> oh. Yay, sneezes. And... Who lives in a destroyer on the sea? <laughs> Whoever these captains are. Marginal victory for the enemy. That's fine, we get to live. So, we've got a bunch of money to build a new battleship with. Do I just build another one of these? I think that'll be the easiest thing to do. No, 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 no. We're not going to build another one of those. We're going to build one of these. Battle cruisers. The battle cruisers could be useful. No, don't build sub, build ship. The Invincible class battle cruisers. Cost 84 million. What do these Jupiter BBs cost me? A lot more. We'll build one of those. And that will be the end of this episode. The war continues. We are blockaded for the moment. We probably won't be too much longer once this first Jupiter gets finished. And we have a bunch more submarines under construction. A lot of them will finish soon. And hopefully we can start waging more economic warfare against them. A lot of our ships are obsolete and needing of rebuilds and refits and everything. Except these things will probably never be refit. They're just minesweepers. They're only meant to patrol overseas. And they really don't have much in the way of structures either. So, see you next time. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I hope you're enjoying. As we continue our war against now both Germany and Russia. See ya.